Hello, welcome back to the Commander's Field Manual. I'm Jade Star. And I'm Guava Moment. Uh, and, oh, that's right. This started off with me not understanding why Shellshock wasn't training. Is she done or what? Injured? What? I don't know. It said it was paused. I don't know why. There. Cat will stop eating plastic now. <laughs> At least away from the microphone. So last time, uh, yeah. Codex Brain Coordinate Mission? Right, yes, the gatekeeper. Gonna be a thing? Yes, we need to go to Madagascar and see what those coordinates were all about. I never remember you needed, was it alloys or Avengers crystals? Yes, or both. both. Yes, okay. Seven alloys, one crystal, not enough. And it's fixed. I don't know, like, maybe it, it was just paused because it was right after a mission completed or something? It was, it was Jake, he fixed it? <laughs> yeah. When has Jake ever fixed anything? Okay, so um, I'm not a big fan of Stasis Field, but, uh, and I don't like Fuse. Oh, I love Fuse. Fuse is so good. Salts and Still Steel are okay. Fuse, so good. No, it's not. It doesn't do enough damage. It... Robs the enemy of an attack and damages them. It's it's, it's a two. Yeah, but when do enemies ever grenade you? Uh, all Never. the goddamn time. Oh, you they do grenade okay. all the time. Yeah. Oh man, look at all those resources. All right. We can okay, go yeah, build, build some stuff. stuff with it. Yeah. <laughs> Although I spent some what can I do supplies you, previously. I don't. I don't have enough for plasma sniper rifles. Damn it. Haha. <laughs> To the black market then? Ooh, rage armor though. Oh, I could have. Upgrade but, that. Uh, yeah, I think the supply drops like six days away. And whoops, did I not build that? I should have built that. Oh, that's right. I know where I need to go and what I need to build first. Icarus My armor. One Illyrium core. Yeah. Yes. That that it's thing is so good. Word as soon as we're finished, Commander. Just give the word and I'll get started, Commander. Nice. Hulk is going to be able to punch things so hard. So who's getting the Icarus armor? Typically you give it to snipers? Really? Um... You know, I don't... I don't have a good base of experience to say, like, who I've tested on as much. I remember giving it to assaults just for the insane mobility it grabs. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, you what for what you use grappling hook for, you can also use the Icarus suit for. Yeah, just which is a good point. Very yeah. quickly get across the uh, field Seven battle up to someplace four, high. Right. 14, Probably a good call. East Asia. Uh, it's not quite as the same as like the flying armor as in the first game. You can't just sit there and fly and be a sniping douchebag while it's off the ground. It's kind of broken in other ways, though. Yeah. And, oh, yep, yeah, this is going to happen. Speaking of stuff that you need... Well, I mean, I have some supplies. I think the... Gatekeeper? The, yeah. Wow, okay, we're already at that point then. Well, I mean, we were already at that point last mission, weren't we? Setting course for Eastern uh, I guess, yeah. Oh, not last. Wait, last one was the UFO. The one well, before that. Two ago. Yeah, two ago. Yeah. Well, yeah, you need those corpses. Oh, gatekeeper shells, yeah. yeah. Yes. Get out of here, Julian. You're, you're, you're sparking all over, everybody. Tasteful editing. Uh, did you give anyone the Icarus armor? It, it takes time to build. Oh, it's okay. Somehow I'm used to things being instant, even though you have to get continent bonuses for that. Right. Somehow in my brain, it always, I always think things are instant. Yeah, I haven't really gotten any of the great continent bonuses this run. Oh well. The ones that lets you just immediately turn Illyrium cores into weapons or ammo or armor is pretty fun. Oh, it's so good. Hmm. Why am I being, being given the option to shoot an explosive barrel? The only time you're ever yeah. given the option of shooting an explosive barrel is, is when there's an enemy nearby that would be ex like hurt by the explosion. Well, you're... You're concealed. You might as well go take a look. Roger that. Got eyes on a hostile squad. 
Oh, but it's right next to uh, some goodies. Yeah. Oh, no, so no, one probably not it. a good idea. Yeah, the shiny glowy thing, so no, no. Uh, and they just barely can see that rock. I would have liked to have hidden behind that rock up there. So why are they still using trains in the future instead of, like, hyperloops? Hyperloops, did you say? <laughs> hyperloops? Loops. Uh, okay. it's one of Elon Musk's crazy concepts. Isn't for that, like the, like, the Tesla guy who thinks the reality is a simulation and we need to go to Mars to break the Matrix? No. Oh. I mean, it sounds like a thing he might say. <laughs> that who's but Musk? no, this is his concept for, like, uh, high-speed bullet trains that travel in a vacuum. And like these vacuum tubes, oh. so they can go like, like even die. fast by Japanese rail train standards. Mm. I mean, it's it's all crazy stuff, but dude's crazy enough to retrieve uh, reused rocket parts and has done it now. So, yeah, good for him for trying. <laughs> I mean, maybe with the invention of Illyrium and like advanced magnetics, just a simple magnetic rail line is as energy efficient as a hyperloop thing. Well, this doesn't look like a magnetic rail line. This looks like the same old standard. Uh, well, yeah, but a third how can rail. you tell if it's magnetic or not? Yeah, it has a third rail there. Maybe there is something to uh, these trains. Yeah. You don't actually see wheels on them, can you? Hmm. This is an interesting derail. Well, I mean, we're, what, 32 videos in? We yeah, yeah. <laughs> talked about Trump last video. Ah. Uh, <laughs> that seemed to go over pretty well, actually. But yeah, uh, I'm, I'm kind of surprised. That, uh, wasn't your joke that uh, the Russian hackers were going to just spam my comment section? <laughs> yes, the paid Russian hackers. Paid Russian hackers, right. Yeah. Nope, don't spot anybody? Okay, good. Oh, wow. Okay, they're so dead. They're, they're very dead. It's just now I'm in their detection range with just about everybody. You could throw a grenade and it'd be kind of awesome. Um, You could void rift. That'd be even better. Mm, would it, though? Well, I guess you wouldn't give XP to people that need it. Yeah. Oh, that was... Uh, I kind of want to take cover behind that rock, but I don't know what the hell is, like, over here in the void, and... Apostate can't lob a, a wiffle ball over oh. the, the mountain. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Yeah, get, get, get the pixel. Nah, I wanted it more away from the rail. Hey, guys. Hey, total don't see me. So, I usually would just launch a grenade in this situation and not worry about it since you get the three guys. Uh, I only have the one grenadier. My grenades are somewhat limited, and I know there's you, a gatekeeper. Your grenades are not limited. Yes, they are. Get I only, out of here with that. I, I only have, like... I mean, like, for uses on this mission, not, like, as a I resource. I only have one grenade per alien. Oh, watch. no. <laughs> I only have two, and I'm saving them for the gatekeeper. Fuck you. I actually know there's a giant <laughs> robotic crab further on in this mission. <laughs> Then rift it. Oh, you're just the worst. <laughs> oh, that's right. One of them's an EMP bomb. I didn't even bring the frost bomb. Fuck you, ground. Yeah. Besides, I don't need to grenade them. They're in a giant Overwatch ambush trap. It's just died. a waste of a grenade. And promotion earned. Nice. Yeah. And someone else earned a promotion because. No, uh, that was that was death from above, probably. I thought I saw two there for a second. What? Oh, hey, gotcha. Lancer. Oh, hey, 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 Lancer. Where is he? What? Huh? Okay. Oh, good. He didn't spot Tallow. Barely. But, uh, hey, you know what's a really good skill? It's Death from Above. On oh, hey, uh... <laughs> okay, sure. Yeah. 
on a grenadier. Target eliminated. I mean, it's a great skill on anyone, but it's doubly great on people that don't require both actions to shoot. On the move. Yeah. <laughs> nice. If you say so. Ah, oh, son of a bitch! I knew it. Oh, well, it's just a viper and an archon. If only you had suits that had a chance to make them go crazy. Hmm. And a skill that could make that archon yours. Well. I have a skill that Ooh. might make that Archon mine, but I have a skill that also would guarantee that the Viper is the mine. Viper? Yeah, uh, I'm okay with that. Still, still looking to see if someone else got a promotion there, because I think it really looked like two people did. No, I really didn't. No? Okay. No. So I shouldn't skip ahead to the end of the video and see who gets promoted. <laughs> you like it when I do that, though, right? No. So, uh, so you're, let's go big. Okay. Gotta go big. Nice. Hey, we got an Archon, buddy. It's nice to mind control those just because they're kind of a pain to kill. Yeah. Got a lot of HP, they're always in like high defense. Flying defense bonus, yeah. Yeah. Armor hit. Pretty sure there are fanfics written about this very moment. <laughs> oh, let's not go to that. Uh, that will that. Blazing Pinions is kind of crap. You can yeah. just go around, like, whacking people or shooting them with your stick. Probably the best option when you've got a mind control archon. Yeah. And using them as bait. I was kind of disappointed how inaccurate they were, but then I realized that that works both ways. That's why they miss me so many times. <laughs> like, standing right next to this person, 75 or 85 to hit. Like,. Yeah. yeah. Also kind of weird is the damage spread. It's 7 to 8 on the shoe and 6 to 9 on the staff. They average out the same. But whatever. Alright, that was... Uh, so that's 5, five down, 6 yeah. left, yeah. 6 left. One of them being your giant robotic crab. Right. That you had better use all of your grenades on. Uh, well, I certainly can't dominate it now, can I? <laughs> well, no, you, the the chances of that happening would have been really bad. I was really kind of expecting something Nothing? there. Nothing? Nothing? Okay. They're probably on the other side of the train, then. Because, I mean, certainly not on this side of it. We'll need to ask twice. Maybe I can get Tatlo up somewhere and uh, find the giant robotic crab before it finds us. And you had better use everything you have on it. Oh my god, I will. I think. Okay. Probably. Absolutely. And you still haven't hit up DX okay. Racer for that uh, collaboration, have you? DX Racer? Oh, but my chair? <laughs> your your horrible, evil chair. My, what? 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 Are you talking about? My chair's fine. <laughs> <laughs> got it. You've got the world's loudest chair to go with your world's loudest keyboards. <laughs> Which I guess the viewer doesn't get a, the chance to experience, you know, since you're not typing during these. But oh my god, your keyboard is so loud. <laughs> it's not like you've got stone it's fists. And his so <laughs> is loud. <laughs> I mean, sure, while well, we got some dead time, why don't we just munch in my giant bottle cap collection? <laughs> what is that for? Good to go. I mean, in case Fallout comes to be true <laughs> and I need apocalyptic Well, you currency. saw the guy that did that, though, right? What guy? Uh, some guy saved up a bunch of bottle caps and sent them into Bethesda. and He said, oh, I think these are worth en enough for a new Fallout game, and they actually sent him a key for it. <laughs> nice. 
And but then they also tweet out saying, "Okay, no one else do this. This was a one-time deal." <laughs> uh, no, I just started tossing bottle caps from my root beer <laughs> underneath my monitor, um, and that's just Clean kind of been. Up. Kind of been going for a while. I can handle that. Got to, you know, every once in a while, just kind of reshift the pile together as it spreads out. It probably smells bad, dude. No. I, I guess that'll be okay. Bottle caps. <laughs> oh, I just uh, can't quite get the third arc on in there. Getting two, it might be worth doing. Ah, they're not alerted. We can probably get them next turn. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> So any other free things you want to uh, beg for right now? Uh, besides a new chair and more root beer? And a new keyboard. I don't need a new keyboard. New president, new representatives. Yeah, that, definitely. New government. Here, I'm gonna type it. Listen to that. Double time. That, that was so loud. <laughs> Unless he, like, did some editing to that, so it... Which I wouldn't put past no, him. No, don't worry. I'm not going to edit that. Like, actually, as, as a technical thing, like, the reason these updates are actually coming out a lot quicker than, um, like, I'd say the teens and twenties did, is because I've stopped doing a lot of audio editing. <laughs> okay, good. Like, like I do the noise removal. I get out a couple bumps and spikes and coughs during cutscenes, things like that. Um, but see, now we can void rift. I hope you're happy. There we go. Which is uh, why my audio sounds like it's all over the place sometimes. So Yeah, so what I used to do for like the first 20, 25 videos, would, I would go through both of our audio, start to finish, and listen to the entire thing, and make minor edits everywhere. And that meant for, you know, an hour-long video, I was listening yeah, to that's... another hour of audio and editing, and it, it took two and a half hours to micro it into... I know like, how that can be, I, I do that too, yeah. So, these Ooh. ones that I'm getting out in three, four days... It's day one is recorded, day two is edited, upload it, day three is try to find Guava, day four is posted. Days three, four, five, and six are trying to find me to record it. Yeah, that, that's the, the slow part now, is just finding a time when Guava's not watching hockey. There's four Archons, that's a... Uh... Oh, the playoffs are coming up, by the way. That's, uh, that's yep. going to be a bad time if you're going to wait for me to not have hockey to watch. Uh... There's a uh, pretty significant chance our two teams might play each other. The Oilers and the Sharks? Yeah. The Oilers are going to make it to the playoffs? The Oilers are challenging for first in the division. Wow. They're ahead of the Sharks. Yeah. Wait, the Oilers are in the same division as the Sharks? Yes. Huh. The Pacific. Uh, Edmonton, I love the Pacific Ocean. Uh, just going out to the beach sometimes. Yeah, that doesn't yeah. That doesn't quite seem right. Um, <laughs> hmm. yeah. But would they play each other in the playoffs? Yeah, in the first oh. round. Oh, okay. I, I don't know how the, the bracketing works. Uh, it's kind of goofy, but it's uh, the most likely outcome. I also remember Edmonton, how the gonna do. if the CFL taught me anything, the uh, Edmonton is also in the east of uh, Canada. No, that's... No. We're in the, the Eskimos are in the Western Division. Except when the Grey Cup happens and they cross over. Oh, right. Yeah, we crossed over to the east. Yeah. Yeah. That, that was playoff shenanigans. <laughs> Or standing shenanigans. But yeah, this is uh, some Archon on Archon violence. Except Archon on Archon this violence is, is basically a coin flip to hit and not very good. Because that's that's a lot of Archons. That is a lot of Archons. Three Archons it's a, is a, is kind a of scary enough. Oh, I, I renamed Man First Gun. <laughs> if you didn't catch that. Oh, what? no, I didn't see that. I was looking at right. the chat. Yeah, next time, uh, next time I select him, you'll see. He'll shoot somebody with it in a minute. So, uh, order of operations matters. Uh, and then this happens. If only you had some grenades to use on that thing. Yeah, if only. Oh, I'm gonna do something that's gonna make you happy later on in this video. Probably pretty you're soon. You're gonna make the- you're gonna let the gatekeeper attack? Um, no. But something else that you- you've wanted to have happen in a while. You're gonna use face-off? Maybe. Ooh. That's a good acid bomb, too. Yep. Yeah, three targets, Take definitely. out some armor, yeah. yeah. 
Gatekeepers have way too much armor. Get all those guys burning, that's real nice. And they're at six health, so they're a shot away from death. Oh, that's right, I forgot, I had James Dean here. I have all of the grenades. I don't know, well, for yeah. some reason, I thought I didn't bring two grenadiers. Whoops, my bad, James. Sorry. And yeah, this is another good move, just saying nope to these two. Deal with yeah. them later. Yeah, wouldn't have done that if I hadn't activated the gatekeeper, but, um... Having six aliens out there, four of them pretty strong. How, how did that do two damage on a critical? I don't, I, I, I don't know. Biggest booms works in mysterious ways. Okay. It's the skill that lets Grenadiers crit on grenades, and I guess it rolled a crit chance, and crits add two damage, and two plus zero huh. is still two. Yeah, that's weird. But it's certainly a thing I did not expect to happen. Do the face-off. Whatever you say. Well, I could. Well, take take your free shot first. Perhaps on one of the guys. Uh, no. Okay. Yeah, that's only you could shoot one of the uh, advent and lower their health. Then face up would maybe kill it. Right. They're burning too. And I forget who I end up shooting here. But pistols never hit, Jade. Look at these chances. 100, 198. 65, 63. But you make up for that with volume. <laughs> yeah, gee, I have a 100% chance to hit something at point-blank range that's frozen. That armor's tough! Anybody's gonna have a hundred. Yes. You get a laser, and you get a laser, and you get fucked. Everyone gets fucked. And you get fucked too. That's also, and you get fucked too. That's what you do whenever you do face off. <laughs> you have to, you have to say, you get fucked, and you get fucked, and you die. Just do the Oprah thing. Okay. You really got oh, a role play. Oh, here's Manhor and his gun. The Trump care. <laughs> Nice, yeah. I mean, this is basically his idea of provi providing healthcare to aliens, <laughs> am I right? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. <laughs> sure, light them on fire, why not? Throw the grenade. Oh, Throw that's right. You can too while you're oh, that's right. I think I put an incendiary bomb on Manhorn for some strange reason. Just use all of the grenades. Use all of them. Sure thing. Oh, yeah, we're going to. There's no point in keeping Talo concealed anymore, though. There's oh, I thought you were just gonna say there's no point in keeping Talo. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna retire him after this mission. <laughs> we're gonna have him go do a burger run to get some Advent burgers. Then you got one more grenade there. Uh, I do. I. Probably forgot it. Okay. Shoot. He's my support. <laughs> and he missed. Enemy is still up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Yep. Acid bombs plus a uh, volatile mix. Uh, really good. Plus a face off. Uh, you know, it kind of helps. Face off was key there. Oh, okay, we're just oh, gonna get very confused. Yep. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Now is that gonna do something? Do something. Do something cool. I mean, well, that's one of the things it can do, yeah. yeah. The big main gun. Yeah, it's got a big eye laser, sure. Naturally. Oh, that's right. I still, I'm still oh, waiting for James Dean makes. to get Salvo. Yeah. Because volatile mix grenades do plus two damage. That was it. Yes. But 
It didn't. It only did to one of them, the one that it critted. Yeah, that's nice. weird. Frost bombs don't do damage. But it said grenades do plus two damage, so you'd think it would do two damage to both of them. No, because it's making a, a weapon that does zero damage do more damage, but it does zero, so it doesn't do damage. But then the crit adds two damage after that calculation. The damage formula has some brackets around it, okay? <laughs> the damage formula's messed up. <laughs> you could do a, an epic plasma blaster in here if you moved a little bit. Uh, probably. I, um... I may have blue screens on Duke, so I may not want to. I may just want yeah. to just shoot him a bunch of times. Oh, right, Halo Bullet. Super good skill, because, um... Fuck dodgy assholes like gatekeepers. With armor, and you got Shredder, and all that stuff. Yep, yep. And hollow targeting. So the next person. Keep your head. Oh, and I poisoned it, as well. <laughs> so it's on its acid and poison right now, so it's wrecked. Yeah. Probably would uh, die at the start of its next turn. I mean, the perfectly safe thing to do would be to freeze two more Archons. Yeah, I do have more if you say uh, so. frost bombs. Let's see what else we can do here. Ooh, so fire. Could I um, the gatekeeper? Damage. Oh, yeah, that would probably put it to. Uh, yeah, that would. Two thirds chance it dies. One third chance it lives long enough to start its next turn and then take poison and acid damage and die. And die, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's just shoot a boosting round. Yeah. Did you see that one? Right. You know, I like that Duke Nukem. You should keep him around on all of your missions. <laughs> we'll see. Unfortunately, the Archons are going to thaw at the end of this turn. Yeah, but how many will be left alive? Ooh, crit for six. Pistols. So much damage. It's volume. The key is volume. No, I, I Death of a key. thousand cuts. It's volume. Volume is the key. doesn't react. Uh, yeah, you could use a uh, soul fire on those guys as well. Yeah, the one uh, at four, I think she can only see the one at ten, unfortunately. So I can't, like, confirm a kill with that. This is why I like having uh, combat specialists. They can use the gremlin to get that last little bit of guaranteed damage on someone. Right. I think I've said before, but my answer to that is stocks. Besides Talos right there. Yeah. Not a fan of stocks, but you're you're showing how they can be used to good effectiveness. You still got this guy. Oh yeah, I, I got my buddy Archon here. So, uh, perfectly symmetrical violence always solves problems, right? <laughs> nope. Well, that's okay. Next turn is gonna miss, right? <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. Perfectly symmetrical violence. Yeah. Oh man, perfectly symmetrical violence is my, gonna be my new Steam name. Yeah, it's a good name, man. Be a good band name too. <laughs> <laughs> it's just shrugged off that shot for a second. Oh wait, no, bleh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, this game sometimes. Yeah, it's good times. Uh, so I think that leads me down to uh, one action and. Just, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I can't ensure a kill chance. on this. Yeah, so we might as well just stasis it. Detected. It's the last thing left alive. It's not going to get its next action. Screw it. Oh, you look so sad now. He's just having a nap. Your tree melted in the top. And then now it's just clean. Who wants the XP? I guess the Archon wants the XP. No, nah, he can do nine. Pops. Look at crit. Ah, oh, yes.
And you could throw him in the ranks with that uh, that guy you picked up on the Avenger mission. Oh yeah, shield bearer. Yeah. I realized, Mike. Oh yeah, I. Uh, oh. That dropped a while ago. I should go get, go get that. it. Go get that. Ah, uh, who am I kidding? If I kill the Archon, the mission ends. Uh. But you'll find out now what it is. If you get it now. Absolutely. I don't know why I'm moving to cover. I. Whatever. You're too cautious sometimes. Yeah. Probably should have had uh, James Dean That's or Tyler take the shot, because I forgot how well promoted Manhor is. Status confirmed. Ooh, free action. All hostiles are yeah. down and the area is secure. <laughs> Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. So, Soldier's Wounded 1, I think that was one damage on Shellshock. And the poor Mimic Beacon. Oh, right. It'll get the award for most shot at home. Uh, I actually don't think it did, but I cut out the uh, loading screens. Oh, yeah. Oh, here we go. Uh, we saturation this? fire versus rupture. Um, saturation fire is interesting. It's just It shoots everything in a cone of fire. It's, it's kind of like kill zone, but not for overwatch and for heavies. And also, you can't click the ability info button on it. <laughs> okay. And then Rupture is just better. Uh, Rupture is pretty good, because you hit somebody with it, and they start taking additional damage from successive attacks. Which from, is really like, good. say, pistols? <laughs> and face-off and lightning hands? Just saying? Uh-huh, yeah. Or just anybody shooting them. Nope, still can't click that button, by the way. Or fanfire? That's plus nine extra damage with a fanfire. <laughs> If they all hit. We also don't have fanfire. You will. At some point. But, but yeah, sure, rupture. Yeah. yeah, rupture. She's she's gone down the right hand side most of the time. James Dean will probably get the left side. Ooh, ah yes. That's a okay. nice one. Yeah. And a scope. Uh, Those are see, things you should install on people outside of the mission. Yeah, I, I think um, after I cut recording I'll put both of those on um, Margaritini, Margaritati. Yeah, and you picked up one gatekeeper shell. Just nice. need one more and can research a thing. Oh, yes. Or manufacture a thing. Manufacture one, yeah. Oh, I gotta do the autopsy first, and then I gotta manufacture it, yeah. We're, but we're, that'll come soon. Yeah, we're, we're being indirect about it, but the gatekeeper, you get the autopsy, and then you get two of them, and that lets you make the advanced psyop. Oh, not psyop, psyamp. So that, and then that your psionic help. soldiers are just unstoppable. Yeah, it, it really boosts uh, psy soldiers. Uh, oh, that's right, apostate is injured somewhere. So she's not training, which is annoying. So, um, screw this guy building that. Let's go plug him in over here. They get apostate healed faster. Okay. I don't know why Kane can't, you know, tend to her. Oh, since he's actually like a medic and everything. We gotta put an engineer to heal him. Eh, whatever, Julian's still five days out. Uh, that's okay, going to be it for should, this video. I'll be good. Yeah, I mean, we're in a good place. Uh, Advent ticker is down. Crew's looking good. I think I don't expand the event queue, but I'm only a couple days away from a supply drop. Then I can get plasma lances. I can get all the shiny, fun toys I want. And then we can go to Madagascar at long last. That'll be fun. I'm looking yes. forward to that one. Yes, uh, that is certainly a mission. We got we to gotta, we gotta just blitz this plot. We got to just plot everything out uh so thank you for watching i've been jade star and i'm guava moment and see you next time